The news is brought to you by the National Bank of the Virgin Islands, Cyril B. Romney Tertola P. Park, NV Salon Nail Spa and Barbershop, Tisley Cross Deliciously Smooth Cider, and Digicel Simply More Speed, Reliability and Entertainment. With Digicel, it's the Christmas that keeps on giving. Switch on to the fastest LTE network with any plan or bundle and get more data to enjoy. More value worth celebrating. More entertainment on the move. And more connectivity to create more Christmas moments. Plus, now there's more ways to win with my Digicel's Pick and Win. There are thousands in cash and prices. With Digicel, it's the Christmas that keeps on giving. Homegrown talent is on the rise in the sport of cricket here in the Virgin Islands, and there is a commitment from the level of the Government of National Unity to continue to support. I see cricket making a real resurgence here in the Virgin Islands. Not just persons who've come from who've come from other places uh, in the Caribbean and in the world, but we see now a, a homegrown talent developing among the young people in the schools, etc. And for me, it's very encouraging. And events like this, I believe, are important in recognizing the significance of cricket and propelling it right here in this society. And certainly, I was very happy to have you know, met with the Cricket Association a number of times when I was a Minister of Sport. And while I'm in the capacity as, as Premier and Minister of Finance, I also will be very supportive of the Cricket Association. And certainly, we've discussed plans to advance cricket here in the Virgin Islands. And I'm very supportive of those, those plans. And I'm looking forward to see cricket advance more. And of course, we want to get to the stage. And we have in individuals who've, who've done very significant things, uh, like, like Brent, for instance, who can help inspire us to even greater heights here in the Virgin Islands. Premier and Minister of Finance, Dr. The Honorable Natalia D. Wheatley, spoke of this observation while giving remarks at the December 6, 2022 inaugural Gold Jacket Ceremony of the Leeward Islands Cricket Board. I certainly want to give very special greetings to the honorees, uh, Mr. Brent DeFreitas and Mr. Max Ford Pipe, as well as the gold jacket recipients, Mr. El Quimido Willett and Dr. Sir Anderson Roberts. And I want to apologize for, for, for being tardy this evening. I've just come from our standing finance committee that generally goes late into the night. And I actually have another dinner I was supposed to be to tonight, which is the Financial Services Commission uh, a dinner. But I, I was determined to get here because I did not want to miss this event because I understand really the significance of cricket right here in the Virgin Islands and the development which is taking place here. And I'm very proud to be here at this inaugural uh, award ceremony, gold jacket award ceremony right here in the Virgin Islands. Uh, my constituency is on the east, the seventh district, of course, 7th and 8th right there. And I know on most Sundays you can go down there and you can meet uh, cricket matches taking place on the green land field. And I see the type of activity that it generates in our community. I see the, the persons who are able to sell their food and their drink. I see persons enjoying themselves with their families. I see persons engaged in, in competition. And it is something that is really good for our community. I know the Virgin Islands was a place where cricket was a sport that was very, very popular. Back in the days of people like Ralph O'Neill and persons like that. Back in the days where persons like my, my parents and grandparents, everyone here was very strong with cricket. And of course, in, in modern times, um, among Virgin Islanders, you have other sports which have become more popular like 
uh, softball and basketball, etc. And let me just say again to um, President Barrett, uh, a, a, a real sincere congratulations for what you've been able to accomplish here tonight. The inaugural event was held here in the Virgin Islands, bringing to the territory persons from the sister Caribbean islands and the U.S. Virgin Islands. We know that where you choose to bank matters, and it is your vote on what your funds do in strengthening our community. As your official bank of paradise, we invest and support the lifeblood of our economy by helping in the realization of personal goals for homeownership, education, and entrepreneurial visions, which support small businesses. We make it our place to connect with persons and worthy causes, and we have been doing so for more than 30 years. Where your money goes and what your dollars empower are your choice. And we thank you for choosing us, a bank that gives where it matters the most, for you, for our community, and a happier tomorrow. The National Bank of the Virgin Islands. Plug into Digicel Plus and get even more entertainment with Disney Plus included. The best of Disney, Pixar, Marvel, Star Wars, and National Geographic all in one place. Whenever you want, plug into Plus to enjoy Disney Plus and much more with a home fiber bundle. Sign up today, Digicel Plus.